There was a free weekend for Ghost Recon Breakpoint, and we decided to test how well the latest update, Operation Motherland, performed on Shadow. We ran a couple of benchmarks on this game that is over two years old now to get a feel for how things are running. We came up with the best configurations for various users on Shadow. Let's get started. As you might know, Ubisoft provides an in-game benchmark tool for most of their games, and we'll run it to perform these tests. The first test we'll run is the full HD resolution test at 1080p. We'll also run the default graphics settings of very high set by the game. This is a long benchmark, so we'll cut it short. But if you're running a 1080p display, you want to keep it right here. The frames are great. The FPS is above 60 constantly and rises over 100 a couple of times. I'm sure you might even be able to get away with bumping it up to ultra settings. I would personally keep it here to maximize frame rates though. If you have a display that is 1440p or 4K, these next benchmarks are for you. Let's go big and try 4K at very high. I have to admit, I was very surprised at the frames with these settings. If you are comfortable with these frames, which is around 40, while playing on Shadow with your 4K TV, feel free to use these settings at very high. The most optimal settings at 4K would be to reduce the graphic settings to medium for a high 40s to mid 50s FPS for great 4K gameplay. Now if the 4K settings aren't good enough or if you have a 1440p monitor, these are my recommended settings for high FPS QHD gameplay. Set your graphic settings to either high or medium, high preferable. Then set your resolution to 2560 by 1440. I use these high settings at 1440p and the game looks great for me even on my 4K TV. High settings will yield frames well past 60 and up to 80. The high settings at 1440p should be your ticket. This is my preferred way to play the game and I believe you will enjoy these settings as well. I prefer playing Ghost Recon Breakpoint on Shadow because GeForce Now doesn't perform the best for some odd reason, Luna doesn't support gameplay over 1080p, and Stadia doesn't allow you to change the graphical settings. Ghost Recon on Shadow is definitely the way to go. If you like this configuration overview of Ghost Recon Breakpoint on Shadow, give us a like and feel free to subscribe so you can get the latest news, gameplay, and comparisons on cloud gaming at the only place where you could do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle. She's not here.